When Jeff asked me at that point in time, I was, I was still skipping a team and we were fairly successful. For me to make the next step in the game of curling, I needed to draw on a little more experience from guys like him, John, Mark, you know, Steve Gould. And from that four-year experience, I feel like I now have the tools required to lead my own team. And it was just a matter of grabbing four guys that were on the same page as me. It really is a you know family that you adopt for a good eight months of the curling season. Um, you spend a ton of time with. You're looking at about three weekends of every month. The definition of a curling weekend is more like a you know Wednesday to a Sunday or Wednesday to a Monday. Uh, so for us, you know, when you're playing with guys and you're you know, even spending the evenings with them in the same hotel room, you got to really enjoy your company. And these guys, I couldn't have handpicked a better group of guys that I want to spend on and off the ice with competing at the highest level in the game. And if we have a one in eight chance at the Olympic trials, uh, it's going to come down to one bond spiel. And if we have the chance to go to the Olympics, we're going to do everything we can to win that spot. Whenever we play uh, a big game, whether it's a big game, a club game, uh, when I'm playing the last shot, I'm doing my best to actually not think. The whole idea is to treat everything, uh, every shot that you make like the shot to win the briar so that, you know, if you're ever getting put in that position where you have to make the last shot, it uh, seems like the norm.